Hello, in this video, we're going to look at how to uh, use a image file as a texture for a shape in Maya. So in this example, I'm going to use a polygon sphere as my shape, but you can do this to any other shape like a cube um, or even just a plane. So you can use an image as a texture for a plane and you can either do it for a whole shape or you can just select different um, faces of a shape in face mode. So to start with, I'm going to create a polygon sphere. So I'll grab the polygon sphere tool and I'll click and drag on the grid just to draw that out. Just grab the move tool and move that up a little bit. Okay, and I might just scale that down just a little bit. Okay. So there's my sphere. Now what I'm going to do is right click on the sphere and scroll down or just move the mouse down until I see assign new material. And I'll click on assign new material. And then I'm going to click on blend. Okay, after clicking on blend, um, you'll see all of its properties in the attribute editor. If you don't see the attribute editor and you have the channel box, and just press Control A until you see the attribute editor. Okay, so in the attribute editor for Blin 1, I am going to go down to Color here and click on the checker box next to that. And then I'm going to choose File. Click on File. And after you've clicked on File, click on the little folder icon next to Image Name. And that will allow you to browse the folders on your hard drive for um, an image file that you want to use. So mine is in a folder on the desktop and it's Earth. So I'm going to use an image of Earth that I found on the internet and I'm going to use this image as a texture so that the sphere looks like planet Earth. So I'll ch click on that uh, file there, click on open. All right, now it's applied that texture. Let's use that image file as a texture for this shape but I can't actually see it yet because I don't have textured mode turned on so I need to click on this little icon here to um, apply it or not to apply the texture but to actually see the texture so you can turn that on and off it still has its texture um, regardless of whether that's turned on or off and you'd see the texture when it was rendered so now I'm just going to zoom in a little bit and just move around and you can see that the, this image has actually worked really well. So it's just the perfect size. Um, and it's actually turned out quite well. Okay. So that is basically how to use an image as a texture. If I go to uh, render view and I'll just do a quick render of this scene, you'll see what it looks like when it's rendered. Um, but this is just using the default lighting. So we could set it up with some better lighting. Um, yeah, that's it. All right, so that's basically how to use an image as a texture in Maya 2016. Thanks for watching.